Hi, I'm Dr. Ed Moore, President of the Independent Colleges and Universities of Florida. We're presenting this video to you to get you a little better informed about what our 30 institutions do to help our great state move forward. Take a look at some of these slides we've prepared. ICUP's mission is serving its members and advancing the interests of these 30 institutions to keep policymakers and other stakeholders in Florida and in Washington, D.C. Our primary mission is serving our state we are private colleges and universities in the public service. Let's talk a little bit about the ICUP family of institutions. As I said, there are 30 of them. The North Florida region has Bethune-Cookman University, Edward Waters College, Embry-Riddle Aeronautical University, Flagler College, Jacksonville University, and Stetson University. Across the central part of our state, we have Advent Health University, Beacon College, Eckerd College, Florida College, Florida Institute of Technology, Florida Southern College, Ringling College of Art and Design, Rollins College, St. Leo University, Southeastern University, the University of Tampa, Warner University, and Weber International University. And in South Florida, we have Ave Maria University, Barry University, Everglades University, Florida Mor Memorial University, Hodges University, Kaiser University, Lynn University, Nova Southeastern University, Palm Beach Atlantic University, St. Thomas University, and the University of Miami. All of these schools are located convenient to just about any Floridian because we have over 135 sites that we'll talk about in a minute. Our profile and the diversity of our programs are 10 research universities, 14 master's universities, six baccalaureate colleges, and the types of degrees that we offer are 21 teacher education degree programs, 10 nursing programs, six engineering programs, five law schools, two medical schools, three business specialty colleges, one art college, and one allied health college. So whatever you're interested in, you're bound to find it at our schools. 30 colleges and universities are rolling all the way from 350 students to over 21,000 students. We have 139 campuses and branch sites, nearly 600 fully online degree and certificate programs, and 156,000 plus students, and over 11 billion in assets just here in Florida alone. Our distance education is very strong and has been in place for a long time. Our fully online degree programs and courses right now have over 32,000 students enrolled and we have an array of programs from 49 associates degrees, 170 baccalaureate degrees, 276 master's degrees, 35 specialists and PhDs, and 38 graduate certificates. Whatever level you are, whatever degree you want to obtain, it's available online through an ICUF institution. ICUF, along with Florida in 2017, joined an NCSERA, which is the National Council State Authorization Reciprocity Agreement, a very long title for a good agreement that was established to serve as a single portal entry to administer the reciprocity agreements from all the 50 states. 23 of 30 ICOF institutions have joined Florida. SARA participation enables our schools to save money. They don't have to go to every state to register to offer programs to students in those states and it enables Florida students as well to enroll in states, uh, other state institutions that are not in Florida. Let's talk about our production annually, how we add to the Florida economy. We grant 4,300 associate's degree per year, over 20,000 baccalaureate degrees, over 12,000 master's degrees, 1,200 PhD degrees, and over 2,500 first professional degrees that include medicine and law. Our output includes areas that are very critical to the Florida economy. The legislature and the governor identified several years ago which are critical areas for degree production to help uh, put our students in Florida jobs. The STEM area, annually we produce over 4,800. We produce over 2,600 degrees in education, over 9,400 business degrees, and over 9,000 degrees in the health professions. This breaks out a little bit the importance of these critical field degrees for our economy. 24% of our degrees are in business, 12% in STEM, 
23% in the health professions, 6% in education, and other degrees, 34% include a wide array of interest and, and economic activity. If you're interested in a degree, we're there to meet your needs. Uh, ICUF serves all of Florida. 55% uh, of our student body are Florida residents. Nearly 60% are female. Over 50% are uh, minority enrollment at our institutions, and 14 of our 30 have a majority of minority undergrads. Our institutions serve all of Florida. Nearly 30% of our undergrads are age 25 or older, not just the traditional 18 to 22 year old college student. Our family income is less than $60,000 for more than half of our student body. 95% of full-time undergraduates receive student financial aid from federal, state, or foundation sources. Nearly 80% of full-time undergraduates receive student financial aid from the college of university that they chose. In 2016-17, that average aid was $12,500 per student. ICUF truly does contribute to Florida's economy and community. Our out-of-state students bring revenue to the state. Our operating budgets total over $5.9 billion per year, and our annual payroll and benefits is over $3 billion for 38,000 employees. We provide athletic, cultural, entertainment, and study programs to the local communities. Our schools are in the fabric of every community they serve. Our institutions promote and often require student volunteer service. If you want more information about ICUF, Go to www.icuff.org and check out our programs. Reach out to us and let us know how we can better help you.